A small town Indiana boy quickly became a global icon during the AIDS epidemic and today marks the 25th anniversary since Ryan White died from that disease. White is remembered as the boy next door whose courage and outgoing nature humanized AIDS around the world. His legal fight just to attend school in Kokomo while living with the then unknown disease made headlines. Back in 1985 at the age of 13 the hemophiliac received an infected blood transfusion. Celebrities like Elton John befriended Ryan White and his family and even played at his funeral. Michael Jackson and Donald Trump visited the family's home. In the 25 years since Ryan died, his mom continues his legacy. President Obama recently signed an extension of the Ryan White HIV AIDS Treatment Act. That's a bill that helps with AIDS research and treatment costs, a project that Ted Kennedy encouraged White's mom to be a part of shortly after Ryan's death. He said, all we want you to do is be a mom. He said, everybody has a mom. He said, tell these senators what it was like to watch your child live and die from AIDS. It puts a smile on my face to think that, that Ryan did so much in the eyes of the AIDS epidemic. AIDS is no longer the leading killer of American, ages 25 to 44, as it once was, but there are 56,000 new infections every year. There are free testing options across Indiana. The Damien Center, for instance, at 26 North Arsenal offers HIV testing weekdays and some Saturdays at no cost.